what's happening once again Tagzilla members and search ranking masters I'm going to take you through today how to post some of your articles and resources in the Tagzilla area on this tutorial so you can expand your influence and your expertise get the recognition and also get some links back to your sites we'll go ahead and get logged in and take you over here to the left navigation menu is where you'll want to be for this as you can see under the main menu here we've got resource articles right here you want to click in that As you can see, there's a number of them listed, the latest articles that have been posted. So what you'll do is, say you've got an article on affiliate marketing. And just as a side note here, the community is about promotion and exposure for your blogs and websites. So we want to keep these article resources must be within that subject matter, that topic heading. So we've got some categories here to guide you, affiliate marketing, blog marketing, copywriting. As you can see, a number of different categories of topics that you can write about and post on that are appropriate here and appropriate for the members. And just for your own time's sake, you want to, one of the big keys in marketing is to speak to your audience, directly to your audience and directly to what they want. That's a big tip. You wouldn't want to post anything in here about gardening because that would really be mostly a waste of your time and there are far better places for you to place that type of gardening example content. So let's just say you had one here about SEO, search engine optimization. See how I clicked in there on the SEO and now right here as you can plainly see submit content in this section. So I would click right in there and as you can see just I would add in my title select category only one because I'm in SEO resources paste your intro paragraph in here because that's what will show on the article listing and then when they click through your main text of your article will show in here and I always recommend to use Arial and 12 point font and set that up before you paste in there so it'll be auto set and of course you scroll down here and as you can see you'll want to publish this I recommend publishing it as public so that the search engine spiders can see it get indexed and get you further exposure and visitors back to your site but if you wanted to you could just make it registered registered members only then it would be hidden from the search box um, again this start publishing finish publishing that's fine in there what you want to do here is get a good meta description that'll also help for your the readers to know what it's about and also to get better search position as well as your keywords which will be tags to help people find your articles within the site so that'll be very important again I'm going to recommend that you make it public for further exposure and recognition because you're writing articles you want to get people to read them that's the whole point point. and just again to reemphasize want it to be news or relevant to marketing and how-to type of info that teaches people how to get more visitors to their site how to make more money from their site those types of things so and we definitely have to have it also to be original content article that you wrote or at least that you have the purchase the rights to and that's original we don't want any no PLR type of articles or recycled articles none of that's going to go up here because we don't want any problems over ownership or copyrights or any of that so just make it original content articles and everything will be fine the resource team reviews all the articles like any good article directory so obviously for your own for your own benefit and your own maximization 
of what this can do for you in terms of exposure and visitors, you want to have a good quality content article that teaches people something. Just throwing up some keywords in a poorly written article is not going to do you any good. It's going to waste your time because the review team can't can't publish that and even if they did the visitors that went to see it would get no value out of it and they would see who the author was and that would hurt your credibility in their eyes so just uh, helpful value-added articles like any good article directory is is what we're looking for and so that's what you'll want to do in here once you are done entering that information you would just hit the little save button right here and everything would be good from there also, I believe there's an alternative way you can access this by going to the big heart up here. Submit your site for love. Okay, got to cancel out of that first. Hold on. Okay, now we can go up here to submit site for love. And then from the categories here we can choose resources user submissions and then the same type of process enter in a good interesting mysterious curiosity peaking title that's gonna just grab people's eyeballs like fish hooks and force them to click on your link that's any good marketing your headline slash title is probably ninety percent of your success or more and then of course your intro text in here again main text you've seen the editor and the same type of tabs down here that you'll need to enter in. So those two different ways to to enter that. This one is going to be broader. I would recommend going through the other way on the left nav so you're more tightly defined in what category you want it to be in. But you can access this either way. And so the other thing we will talk about as well in this video when we're talking about resources and articles are the bookmark resources here. So we'll click on that. Oh, that message again. And cancel out of that. Or actually, I guess it took me here. Okay, good. We're here in bookmark resources. And so we would click submit new bookmark. And then choose the correct category so as you can see internet marketing is the category we're looking for and we'll probably add some more detailed categories in there as well of course right in here you'll type in as you can see URL so type in the URL of the resource and the text box here will be as you can see description so type in a one to two sentence description of what the link is all about again if you can make it interesting exactly to the point this is what people on the site are going to see and what's going to induce them to click on your link get them to click on your link and once you do that we will just go over here and show you this part and the save button is right over here on the right you will hit this little disk here that says save and obviously if you made some mistakes somewhere or just want to cancel out you would click right in there so that will conclude this tutorial video on article resource submissions what kind of marketing internet marketing categories that we're looking for to help you get your exposure and recognition and also the bookmarked resources that you find that are very valuable to our members certainly include those in here. I will see you on the next tutorial.